Oh, good eye. What's that? You call that a knife? That's not a knife. This is a knife. That's not a knife, that's a spoon. Well, I see you've played Knifey Spoony before. Just one of the many games we play here down under. Anyway, got to get back to my ranch. You're welcome to drop by whenever you want. I'll see you there. Alrighty, so we're here on the big new lot, which I'm super excited about, but we got to make some changes. Because uh, a lot of this is not going to be off the grid. Actually, we need to do the traits and stuff too. We've already got the Prairie Grass uh, challenge. Going to add Simple Living, going to add off the grid. Reduce and recycle. Do we want to add any others? Cursed, creepy crawlers, filthy. I don't think I want to do every lot challenge. I mean, we could do foxes maybe. Being a nuisance to your garden. No, let's wait. I, maybe, I don't know, would foxes exist in this environment? I could imagine it being down in the green grassy ranch area. I don't know about up here. I mean, you can let me know. But also, I don't really want to do foxes, so that. Uh, tiny home. This is a little too big, but I think, oops, we can probably reduce the size. If I just remove the roof over here. So in my last lot, a, a few of you pointed out that um, my tiny home became a lot bigger. It's because I did a roof like this. Um, actually, did they do ceiling on this? Oh, they did. Sweet. That's a shame. I'm going to remove it. Oh, God. It deleted half my columns. Hang on, hang on, hang on. I'll just do it this way. Remove floor. There we go. All right. So now we're down to 82 tiles. So it is a tiny home. But what benefit does it actually give? Oh, lower bills. Actually, that's pretty good. And we're more happy. So actually, that's good. We don't get the skill boost because our, our, you know, our house is pretty big. But that's okay. I, I think that that's fine. Because to be honest, we've got a lot of skill boosts anyway. I'm not too worried about that. All right. Power wise, what have we got in here? Is this actually power? This is functional off the grid. So these lights do not need power. This little one does, though. I'm going to remove everything that needs electricity. That includes the fridge, the stove. Oh, actually, you know what? Hang on. These actually might be functional off the grid. Some of them are. This one is functional off the grid, so that in theory could be fine. And this, this one is not. I'm going to remove that. We're going to replace that one with the cottage. Actually, did I bring it with me? I did. Okay, let's just put that in so I don't buy a new one. And we'll match it in a little bit better. So we've got our off the grid fridge. Um, any other lights? There's this one. What's this? This is not functional off the grid, so I'm going to get rid of that. We're going to get our little lantern. You know, they're not even really lanterns. It's, just a, it's literally just a candle in a thing. <laughs> All right, so hang on, let me go to night time. So what, what lighting have we got? That's actually pretty good, those lights. Can I get one in the bathroom maybe? It doesn't fit anywhere in here. Let's go off the grid filter, lighting. There was like, oh, there's a couple of wall lights. There's this one, and I think this candle one as well. Actually, this one's good. <laughs> you cannot see it at all in the shower. Yeah, look, you're gonna need a shower in the daytime. Yeah, whatever, that's fine, whatever. Very nice, look at this place, it's beautiful. Okay, so water, obviously we've got this toilet, which is functional off the grid, but I feel like it's not thematic enough to our environment. So I'm going to get rid of it. Now, actually, apparently I'm not even sure how we make this toilet. How do we get this? Because people are saying once we get high enough skill, we're going to end up making this toilet, which I also remember that that's the case. Like you craft this toilet. So how do we get this one? <laughs> Like, how do we make, because this is the toilet I want. And actually, to be honest, I want an outhouse anyway. I want this like in an outhouse somewhere. Shower is fine. I like that. I like that. Well, why don't we just, I'm just going to build an out. Actually, is it? There's no public toilet just nearby, is there? No. I'm just going to build a outhouse. So where's my, my little porch is there. Um, we could do a little outhouse maybe over here. Probably the outhouses, they have to be kind of big. We could maybe fit it in a one this size. I mean, it looks a little silly with this roof. Hello? <laughs> what was that? Don't worry, it was just some Lego falling down. Not built, it's okay. Oh cool, when I put that in it looks <laughs> great. Awesome, that's so good, thanks game. So I need a little door. Yeah, I wish we had like a little outhouse door. Like we've got um, this kind of door, but I really want one that just has like the little moon cut out. You know, that's what we need. Also, oh gosh, what is this wallpaper? Why did it do a pole here and one here, but not here? You're ruining my outhouse dreams, game. I might have to use one of these instead. It doesn't have the vertical log. There you go. That works. A little ranch window. All right, so for now, I guess I'm just going to buy this toilet. We will craft a toilet, but I think we're going to end up crafting th this one, which is kind of annoying. So we're just going to go with this for now. And then, of course, we need a sink. You know what? I might just go with this one with the hose. Even though it's got like towels and stuff under it, which looks a little silly. I think overall it probably looks a little bit better. All right, that's gonna go there. Cool. So we've got a toilet. All right, so off the grid stuff. Actually, so you guys are suggesting, so we were, well, basically we got a bunch of off the grid items that actually don't need electricity, including the fridge, because we can add ice. So I actually don't need a turbine to generate power because there's no point. And if I do that, then my fridge is going to keep turning on and off, you know. 
Um, and actually, speaking of off the grid, do we ever know if the grid sinks in here? Or is that just another thing? Oh gosh, I've got a lot of debug stuff, go away. Um, plumbing, so there is, oh, there's this tub too, which is off the, this is like so good. So wait, I don't, I don't think we craft this tub either. I think we craft a different tub. I thought we crafted the crappy stuff, but I think we actually craft the nice stuff. Like I think this is the tub you end up crafting, right? Or is there a chance of this? Oh, I don't know how it works, it's been so long. Anyway, we can just buy this, it's not even a debug thing. Uh, Kind of seems like we should. Oh, I could have got this for our outhouse. A little much though. Okay, wait, what am I doing? Sorry, I'm getting distracted. Sink. I guess we should do one of these and just replace this and the counter. Why don't we just replace it with the this one? Even though we've got one just there as well. I'm gonna do another one right here. Yeah, there you go. Nice. I definitely feel like, yeah, we've already got this one, but I kind of feel like we need one of these. Oh my God, that's $2,000. Maybe the cottage living one. Functional off the grid. Yeah, yeah. This is definitely, that fits in way more for sure. I love the green ones. Yeah, there you go. Okay, so what do we actually, we've got all our stuff here. An act, oh, I need a cellar. Maybe we could do it down here, like so we can enter outside. Oh, this is gonna mess up my tiny home. Oh, actually no, 100 out of 100. We can still be a tiny home, as long as I don't build any more. Hang on, if I do move up, so, okay. Here's what I'm doing. Apparently, I don't know if this works. Can we use tool to like rotate this? If I go like 90 degrees. Oh my gosh, okay, this works. So this is a mod that allows you to like rotate, scale and move objects in more ways than the game does. Tool by Twisted Maxi. And someone suggested we just do a gate like laying down and place it over the hole and it will still like animate when a sim walks through the fence. So why don't we try it? Does this work? Let's see, climb down. Oh, <laughs> guess I did it wrong. Uh, looks cool though. Okay, I, I don't know. Cause I, I, put the, I put the gate here. So then it was actually a gate. So like if it's here, like it like does that. And then I use tool to move it here. But then when you do that, it just goes, you know, I should just look it up. Let me look it up. All right. Oh God, lady, you're right. All right. So this is a little bit bigger than what I was trying to do with the gate, but this totally works and it looks really, really cool. I couldn't really figure it out. So I just looked up a tutorial, which if you're interested is by Helene. Uh, I'll link this tutorial in the description down below because it's really good. It goes over exactly how to do it. So thank you very much. Fantastic tutorial. And uh, they show a few different ways that you can sort of do it. There is actually a gate there, but I figured if we were gonna do like the roof thing, we might as well just use a door because I think it looks pretty cool. So yeah, check it out down below. Okay, so let's go ahead and uh, actually make a cellar now because I just, I know it doesn't look like it, but I just spent so much time trying to figure that out. I also gotta remember, I got a bunch of stuff in here, which I did also realize after I already purchased another lamp. Like I think I've got a few of them. But that's okay, we can use these as well. I can probably sell some stuff, so I'm not too worried. All right, well this, why don't we just adjust this a little bit because I don't know if I want, we might as well have it go maybe this way a little bit. So it's sort of, the stairs are on the edge of the cellar. I think that, uh oh, <laughs> that's completely destroyed. Okay, hang on, undo, undo. Okay, don't drag the walls around, just be careful. All right, so I think, well, it's a cellar, so it should be like stone, right? I guess we use a new stone, the horse ranch stone. I don't know if this really makes sense for a basement though. I kind of feel like it maybe should be like that or even like that or, or like that, that's kind of cool. But we'll just do this. We'll, we'll just use the one we've got, the new one. I do the same wood flooring down here though. I quite like that. And then I'll do it as a ceiling as well. Oh wait, how much is this gonna cost me? Wait, why are these two separate rooms? Oh, don't ask questions. Oh wait, is this gonna destroy my roof? No, it didn't, okay, we're good. Oh, I guess I should use rafters. Wait, what is going on here? Oh, that's the kitchen cabinets. Wait, what the, oh, what? <laughs> Hang on, wait, how do I, where'd my ceiling go? How do I get my ceiling? Game, hello? I'm in ceiling mode, but it's not showing me ceiling. Oh, I have to select a tile first, okay. So this has got two ceilings, so I'm just not gonna do that one because that one's gonna cost me money. And I assume the only one we see, wait, do you even, oh no you do, okay. I mean, we're never gonna see that. Why am I wasting money on it? Because even in this mode, you don't see it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm not doing a ceiling. Okay, anyway, sorry, I'm getting really off topic. So, all right, so Nectar, what we're gonna do, well, let me turn move objects up. I, don't, I want this to actually work properly. Do they fit under the stairs? No, nothing ever does, does it? Be too perfect. Okay, I feel like that's a little too far in the wall, you know? Like if we just move it out a bit, put it there. Do these snap together? Oh, they don't snap sideways, that's a shame. Sorry, right, I'll just do it manually. So why don't we have like regular there? Oh, we need to have like, um. oh no, wait, if I build walls, is that gonna destroy my roof? Hang on. So if I just do this. Okay, the, the cellar door thing is very cool, but it is very annoying. <laughs> okay, no walls. So, okay, what I wanna do is I wanna create like a, a separate little room for like our excellent quality, you know? Cause I, just cause I think it'll be cool. Now, I guess we're on a tiny little cabin. I was gonna make it like really fancy, but no, I probably shouldn't. 
I'll just use like, um, can I use this? Yeah, just like an archway for now. And then maybe later on we make it like a nice little room. But yeah, so it's a separate little room. Oh yeah, the lighting is weird because this is technically outside. That's why this looks different to this room, but that's fine. I don't, I don't mind. Um, all right, we do have some lights. This will only work uh, at night time. Go. Maybe can I get a shelf? I guess it's also a cellar. You don't really want any sort of heat source, which this would be. Maybe we shouldn't even have lights in here. Maybe we'll have one light. Yeah, we'll put the lantern on the shelf in the cellar. There you go, that's nice. Kind of a little close to the stairs, maybe. <laughs> put it like there. That's good. And then maybe in this room, I don't know. Should I have any light? I mean, during the daytime, for some reason, it's lit up. It's just when it's nighttime, it's not. <laughs> anyway, we'll get some more nectar. So for now, I mean, I think we're not gonna have that many excellent bottles, so I'll just get the one. I'm gonna do it sideways, because it looks cool. And because it's our special rack, it can be a lighter color. All right, do I have anything special I can add in here with it? Just for funsies? I mean, not really, what, what would go in here? All right, let me get, let's get the other stuff, because I'm spending a lot of time on that. Uh, I don't think I'm gonna do any more walls down there, so let me just put these back. Okay, so I've got my trees just randomly in a line over there, that's fine. Oh yeah, apparently, actually, the reason I couldn't put the trees in there was also apparently better build by, and I had to enable debug just to put the trees in my inventory, so I don't know. <laughs> I don't know, look, whatevs. All right, so where do I actually want my plants? Probably over here, because it's kind of like a nice open space around the back. So why don't we set up like a little crop area? Now I'm just gonna place these out in no particular order. And then, all right, actually, are these all great? These are all great. Okay, but all the grapes can go together. But other than that, I'm just gonna kind of do whatevs. I'm gonna get some more of these, because we can afford some more. And then I have one by itself. That's kind of annoying. <laughs> I have one extra. All right, so that's nice. We got a little, uh, little planting patch over here. Maybe we can, maybe diagonal. That might be nice along the, with the rocks. Look at this. Oh, I don't know where this one would go though. Well, hopefully they actually work on the diagonal like that. I mean, I guess I don't see why they wouldn't. All right, so the trees, well, I've just got them there. It's a bit random. Maybe we should just have like a little, almost like a little orchard kind of thing here. Where are my planters? Here we go, I've got three of them here. So let me go one, two, three. We'll have to make more of those. Fortunately, it means all my, I'm gonna have to grow all the trees again. But that's all right. Okay, that's all those. All right, so now for the, well, okay, horse stuff wise, I've got another horse bed, which I guess, to be honest, I might just keep because we're probably gonna get another horse. So I might keep that. I've got another one of these. We've got one just there. So which one's worth more? This is 40. Is this the same? The, they're both 40s. I'm gonna get rid of it. I don't think we need two of those. Um, the animal feeder, there's one there. You know what? We might actually get two animal feeders because I think we'll do mini goats and sheep in their own little pen. Should we do it? Maybe not out over here. We've got a bit of space at the back. Yeah, it kind of makes sense. It's kind of near all this. I like this tree and these this grass, but I'm just going to move it a bit. There's more over here. Then we can make like a little pen. Do we do this fence or the ranch fence? Wait, how much is the ranch fence? And how big is it? Hang on, hang on. I've got the, the scale. Okay, there's our little baby sheep. This fence is way too big. It, it would just walk under it. <laughs> <laughs> what about this? That, I mean, is better, but I kind of feel like it's still not the right fence. Well, this guy can jump. I was gonna say this, but I mean, they obviously can't jump over fences, but that fence is too small. <laughs> That'd be way too small. What about like this? It's kind of, wait, how much does this cost? 46, ooh. What about this? You know what? Let's do the werewolf one for now. You know, we're just starting out here with our little our mini animals. So we wouldn't have like the best pad or like the best little enclosure for them yet, but I think this is nice. I feel like it fits the vibes. So I know this looks kind of ridiculous because it's super tall, but apparently you got, I didn't know this, but you guys were saying these guys can eat out of the horse feeder, which is also why the horse feeder was actually empty most of last part, which I didn't realize. And I guess that's probably because they were also eating from it at the same time. So that's just something I'm gonna have to keep an eye on. Um, and we're gonna use the new gate. No, not that one. I wanna use the um, this gate. I kind of wish I had a matching fence for this gate because it's pretty cool. We do it this side. I, it looks too big on the diagonal, so I was gonna put it over here somewhere. Yeah, I like the gate. It's pretty cool. Yeah, we'll do that. Uh, actually, I kind of wanted to open the other way. No, no, the other way. No, no. Yeah, there we go. So the hinges on that side. Cool. So that'll be there. Should we do like a little, uh, little lake, little pond for them to drink out of? I know that they won't use it that way, but might be well nice for them to have. Uh, make sure the fence is flat, and then I'll bring up some of this side as well, just so it's not right against the fence like that. What does that look like? <laughs> That's so bad. <laughs> I need to like, if I can just smooth it a little bit, it'll be good. Yeah, it doesn't need to be big. Yeah, I just need to like round the edge a little bit. Just so it's not so pointy. Hey, there you go, that's looking better. How's that? Yeah, that's all right. The fence is a little wonky, but you know, kind of fits the vibe, so that's all good. Okie dokie. Now let's get some of these plants around the place. Maybe a nice tree in here as well, just so they have a bit of shade. Obviously not <laughs> at the moment, but at other times of the day, there'll be shade. I guess, actually, no, speaking of which, maybe we should do like a little, they should definitely have like a little cover. Yeah, yeah, let me let me do like a little one here. 
Kind of wish it could be a little smaller than that. All right, so we got the same sort of little cover thing. I think I'll move this tree just so it's not like right on top of it. Put it just outside maybe a little bit better. Okay, so that's there. And then should our fence be a little bit richer in color then so it matches maybe a bit better? Maybe more like this. Yeah, why not? All right, chickens. Yeah, you're gonna get a chicken in here. Gonna get a chicken? Well, yeah, actually, you know what? Yeah, maybe we'll start with one chicken because honestly, maybe more than that might be too much. Uh, but you know, we gotta get going on this. We gotta get, we gotta get the ranch going. All right, so they're gonna be there. I don't think we'll have cows just yet because let's go like, let's, you know, build up to it. I do have, um, actually, I don't know if I have it installed right now. First of all, where do we even find the animal shed stuff? Is it in here? Here it is. Chicken coop, that one. Um, I have, oh wait, I might need to turn on custom content. Yes, I do have it installed. So I've had this for a while. The free range animal shelter marker. So this basically, just this item is the same as this whole thing. And you can just get a cow or a llama and they can just walk around wherever they want. And then you just put this down where they feed so we can put it inside some plants and they'll go there and like they'll sort of feed in that area. Um, so we'll do that. Not right now. Uh, okay. Oh, I had another one of these. Why did I buy more of them? You know what? I'll just put this next to one of these. <laughs> Okie dokie. In the house. Um, might get all our, our little awards maybe in the bedroom here. Oops, I bought one. Uh, just because when we have the walls like cut away, we can still see them. Because if I put them somewhere else in the middle, we'll never see them. But I like that we can see them here. Do they have different colors? Oh, wait, I can just... Oh, hang on. I think I've got... Because of debug. Wait, what? Wait, I can just change my awards? Wait, that can't be right. I think I've got a weird debug bug version of this. <laughs> uh, we'll, we'll not do that. I don't think it's supposed to do that normally. Don't worry about it. It's just mods, guys. Oh, clothes line has to go under cover. Can it fit on my porch? Otherwise, I'm not gonna be able to dry my clothes when it's raining. Oh, can I just extend the back roof maybe? Do you reckon that'll be enough? I wonder if that will count. Move these rocks a little bit more there. And then just get some columns out here as well. I mean, it looks pretty cool. I like that. If that works, I'm happy with it for sure. And I guess I'll just put the wash tub next to it, to be honest, because otherwise we're gonna have to walk like really far away to get to it. So we'll wash there and just go straight in there. Yeah. My other shelf, I guess I'll just go in here and I'm gonna put my scouting trophies on there. These we won't see because the wall will go down and we'll never see them ever again. So I've got a nice rug. Uh, this can go to the bedroom, why not? Heck yeah. Wait, why do I even have this rug? Did I buy this at my last place? I don't remember owning a rug. Did we unlock this somehow? How'd I get a rug? <laughs> I don't know. Oh well, I've got a cooler, which I guess I don't really need, but we'll put it out here. All right, nectar making, where are we gonna do that? By the horse bed? We probably, oh, we need like a little, we need another like undercover area. Maybe over here. Cause all our plants are back over here. Maybe we could do like a little shelter here-ish. Okay. I like it with the one wall at the back there cause I kind of feel like we could just sort of place this uh, kind of up against it maybe. It's still a bit random. We definitely need like an enclosed barn or something I think for this, but I'm happy with that for now. Uh, our recycler, this is also kind of just random thing, isn't it? <laughs> it doesn't really fit under my nectar space. Also it doesn't really make sense in my nectar space. So, well, where am I gonna put, we, Need an outdoor trash can. Does this lot have one? It should do, shouldn't it? There's an indoor one. There's a mailbox, there's a rocking chair. Is there no outdoor trash or is it, am I missing it? All right, whatever. Okay, I'm gonna get rid of my fireplace because we don't need that. I'm gonna get rid of this camping chair. Uh, horse, do we have a horse ball? There's no horse ball. I'll add one in, here we go. Uh, I'm gonna keep that bed. Okay, I'll do collector for water. I'm just gonna put over here so we don't see it as much. There you go, just go over there. Uh, we'll have to keep an eye on that because we're gonna have to repair that when it breaks. Uh, we have a ratty old armchair, which I like. Add that in. Got the family keepsake box, which I guess I'll put, here. Yeah, put it on the man. Oh God, is that gonna catch on fire? Let's not put it there. <laughs> we'll put it, uh, where am I not gonna forget it? I'm gonna forget it wherever I put it, aren't I? I'm gonna put it on this half wall. Cause that will stop us putting plates there too, which would be handy. All right, woodworking. Maybe this can go, oh, though, you probably wouldn't want to be using sawdust and chopping up things next to where you're making nectar. I need like another undercover area. <laughs> I mean, we've got the space for it. Got a little outhouse, got a random barn. Uh, no, I guess a little. We definitely need to get some more like decoration stuff for the garden area. Cause I think this would be really nice with more decorations around the place. I think maybe this should be facing this way. Might do another wall here. Maybe get rid of that wall. Just so the nectar's sort of more facing towards the rest of the stuff. Yeah. Um, woodworking, woodworking. What about just here? Maybe it's a bit random, but just extend the roof more. So then it's like a, an even bigger sort of porch area here. Let me just move this stuff under here. I mean, I think I'll do for now. I'm not particularly happy with that. Um, also the water next, being next to the wood is a bit strange, but it's fine. Oh, there's our bin. Cool, all right, it's over there. Good to know. <laughs> I knew there would be one somewhere, I just didn't know where it was. Okie dokie. Well, we've got a few extra things. I guess I'll just put this mirror in somewhere maybe. Um, uh, um, 
Uh, is this is this off the grid? What is this? It did say electric? Okay, that is power. And hey, there's one there too. Get rid of that. Sneaky little power consumers. Hey, there's one here too. No power. Look at this. Does this use power? It doesn't say it does. So I'm gonna assume that we're okay having a smoke alarm. Okay, no other wall lights anywhere. I think that's it. I get a, oh, I'll put a lantern here because then that will light up this area a bit too. And I've got a few spares. Can get one on the porch here. Okay, so the only thing I got in my inventory, actually, hang on. No, no, I've got more stuff. Debug, yes. I got my little macaroni horse picture. Oh no, did it, ru did it get ruined? Oh no, we're good. Oof, that was close. I'll put it on this wall so we can always see it as well. <laughs> Uh, okay, and then manure, I'll put that down here. Okay, now we've just got the bed in there, that's fine. Okay, so this is our little animal uh, pen, I guess. This is where our little horse and our uh, bar two are gonna live, and the chickens as well. Uh, obviously we might make it bigger later on, but that's fine for now. Then we've got our little laundry section at the back here, a little crafting area just under there. Our plants and uh, sort of, um, what do you call it? Orchard, uh, just here, well those, they will be trees eventually. Nectar making is kind of over there, it's a bit random, but uh, I don't know, look, we'll, we'll, we'll work it out as we go. Cool, and that's that. That took me, <laughs> this took me so much longer than I thought it would, but I'm really happy. I think this has come along, oh, and of course we've got our cellar without where we're gonna keep our nectar. Um, cool, I guess, well, really I guess the cellar should be on this side of the house so then we can get to it quicker. Do I move it? Do, do I go through the effort of moving it here? I think it'd make a lot more sense, wouldn't it? Okay, there we go. That was that was way more work. Uh, okay, you know, I didn't think us moving into this and me just adding a couple things would take this long. Obviously, for you, I cut out a lot of it, so <laughs> don't worry about it. But holy moly, that took me way longer than I thought. But now, all things going correctly. Live mode, we should be able to do everything we need uh, with off the grid. Uh, my food is off. I'm gonna have to go add some ice. Yeah, there's no ice there. Oh, look at look at this little cell. Isn't this cool? That's great. If we go up a level, we can see that. Oh, oh, there we go. It, it opens a little late, but that's okay. Just a little bump on the head. There's nothing to worry about. Yeah, I love that. It's so cool. Okie dokie. All right, well, hang on. First of all, I gotta pen these guys in. Lock for, uh, I'm gonna say everyone. And then I'm just gonna say allow access to Household, and then I'm gonna say allow access to employees, uh, which uh, is a ranch hand and a, you know what, I'll do employees and ranch hand just, just so it's there. All right, so that should keep these guys in there. I gotta, oh God, I gotta make sure, oh my God, what is with my needs? Hang on, I gotta, oh, so where's flame? Hey flame, oh my God, wait, oh no. <laughs> I, I thought those are flame's needs. No, flame is fine, flame is good. All right, let me take care of my own needs real quick. Oh, hang on, I gotta go to the outhouse. <laughs> I'm just go to the outhouse, don't mind me. And then I gotta go take a shower. Hello? You've been chosen! Yes! I knew I had been! I'm awesome! Who's this? Oh, you got pranked. Oh, Cherry! <laughs> Cherry, why'd you do that to me? Alrighty, I'm pretty happy being here though. This is so cool that we're now in this area. Um, is there, question, a... Oh, Krista! Hey guys, it's me, Krista. Yeah, I'm just walking here in Chestnut Ridge. Thought I'd just hang out. Uh, and the Galloping Gulch, just by myself. You know, it's all good. Nice to meet you. Well, not me, see you. Um, no, what I was gonna say, is there a community board here nearby? Like, uh, I know there's one somewhere, it's down over here. Cause we can enter competitions here, which is good. But I'm wondering if we just get a community board on my lot just so I don't have to try and find it every time. We're going back to build mode, let's go! Community, ranch community board, here we go. I'm just gonna put it, I mean, if it's on the edge of the lot, it kind of looks like it's in public space, so let's put it there. We probably should, oh, how much are those ranch signs? Wait, how much is this? 450, oh yes, you gotta get a ranch sign. Oh! Now you can put a whole bunch of different stuff on this. And I think, can I put my awards on it? Yes, I can. We can put, that makes more sense, let's do that. Let's put all our award winning belt buckles. Whoops, on these, at least I think they're like belt, they kind of look like a giant belt. It's like in wrestling when you <laughs> win the belt. There we go, put all Flames awards up over there. Aw, look how proud we are of Flame. And then we need, why am I in build mode again? I don't know, I don't know guys. <laughs> Where's my, ah, yes, here we go. I mean, this is, this thing here is on the logo of Rax and Ranches. I don't know if you guys noticed, but I, I basically traced it in uh, Illustrator, turned it into like a little vector image and that's our logo. So I feel like we need, oh my God, make it bigger, yes. Wait, where'd it go? Come back, come back, don't leave me. <laughs> I think it's because I'm too close to the edge of the lot. Let me just move back a bit. Oh, that's pretty cool. Which one do we do? What color ranch uh, things do we have too? Ooh, I like that one. A little bit more faded here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, look at this. Nice. Name ranch. Oh, what are we going to call the ranch? For now, obviously Big Wallet Ranch, but if you got any other names, please let me know. Oh, look at this thing. Isn't that beautiful? Hey, Flame. You need fun? Well, we've got a horse ball. 
You can go play horse ball if you want. All right, I don't, <laughs> I don't know how long this video is so far. There's a lot of uh, building and renovation stuff I had to do. All right, I also need to get a chicken. And I need to make sure these guys are okay. Oh, why don't we just hire a ranch hand? Let's, let's go ahead and do that as well. Apparently they is potentially, surprise, surprise, uh, oh wait. <laughs> Uh, okay. I can't call a, <laughs> I can't call for serve like for a ranch hand because I got no pal. Oh, hey Chris, so you actually came to visit. All right, let me just uh, invite him. Of course. Hey, it's me. I thought I'd just come visit the ranch. Uh, I heard you moved and uh, I didn't really like where you lived last time. So I thought I'd come check out the new place. Oh, cool. I just have some food. Uh, are we going to talk to each other? There you go. Yeah. Hey Chris, look at our relationship. We're like best friends. All right. I'm exhausted and stinky. So anyway, at least hunger should be good. Hey Chris, so you can hang out. Uh, what I need to do is get power. So I guess I do need to get a power generator, which is a shame. I didn't really want to off the, whoops, no, not water features, off the grid. Um, we need, where would it be? Oh, it's, I forgot about storage boxes. Oh, hang on, I'm filtering horse ranch. Uh, would it be in the power category? No, it's an outdoor activity, apparently. <laughs> it's an act outdoor activity of generating power. All right, well, should we just get these? Are these, these are better power rating, power product. Oh, actually the, no, the turbines generate more power. Okay. Well, let's just try one again. Maybe that'll be enough. Cause you guys are saying I should also, I, I forgot this was a thing, but if I click on the fridge, I can say, uh, apparently I can't. There's supposed to be an option that I can tell it not to use power and only use the ice that I add. Oh, what the heck, Krista? Are you yelling at me? What the heck? What happened? <laughs> what did I do? Maybe I have to wait till we're actually generating power before that option shows up. All right, go sleep on the actual bed. Wow, I really like it here on the ranch. Yeah, I think I might just light the fire and then walk away. Krista, do it. Light the fireplace. Set the house on fire. <laughs> now let me try and get some energy here because I'm so tired. Oh no, what's wrong? Wait, why are you just out here? Go, go have fun. Why? You haven't even moved. Are you like, wait, what do you mean you can't route? Hang on, reset. Can you move now? Okay, hang on. I was supposed to play flame. What are you doing? Where, where are you going? Just go onto the lot. Okay, well you're eating the prayer grass. So th that's actually good. So then your hunger will be good. Oh, actually, yeah. Speaking of which, I gotta go fi fill up these. Uh, go refill that please. All right, so I've asked flame to, oh, there we go. Okay, I think, I think we're good now. Flame is playing. Hey guys, it's me, your mama. <laughs> actually, how are you guys? Fine and clean. There you go. We could probably actually put one of the prairie grass uh, growing things in here. Let's also purchase a chicken. Oh, do I have enough money? Ooh, I don't. But we could get a uh, a hen chick, 75. You know what, let's do it. There you go. Uh, no, 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 can, can, I, can I see the, uh, hello? Oh, there it is, yay! Aw, I'm gonna feed you and I'm gonna milk you for simoleons. <laughs> I'm gonna shear you for simoleons. <laughs> Look at this. All right, so I got plenty of chicken feet. Actually, yeah, so let me go to buy mode again. We're going to buy mode, guys. Uh, I'm gonna get some more prairie grass. There it is. You can get one of these in here because this will just grow us grass for them. And then they can eat from this as well as that. So if I forget, then hopefully there's plenty of options. Yeah, some goat milk. There you go, 22 bucks. Shear you. All right, how's flame doing? Social low, hygiene low. Okay, well, I'm gonna take care of you. Oh gosh, uh, I'm, mm, I might need, a, wait, how did you get in here? This is, lo oh, I unlocked for household. And because flame is technically in the household, that lets flame in here. I mean, that, that's fine. You know what? That's fine. You probably should be, oh, look, they, that's, that is nice. We should let it, we should let that happen. I mean, is it a little strange that the horse would be able to just walk through the gate? Uh, but whatever. Did the goat just pee or did the horse pee? I'm, I'm not sure who did that. Let's just clean up the horse too. There you go. Hygiene good, social low, tell a joke. Do I have power yet? No. Are we generating power? How am I using it? I have my, how do I have minus 15 power? What did I do? What did I do to deserve this? Don't, don't worry, Chris, I'm coming, but, oh no. What, what's wrong, are you scared? Okay, you're in a good mood though, so that's all good. You guys, a good mood? Yeah. All right, I'm gonna leave you now. I gotta go to bed. Well, I gotta get, let me go talk to Krista because I do need some friends. You know what? I'm gonna give you a residence key so you can just come by when I have. Be nice to just have people drop by. I know they, obviously she dropped by herself anyway, but might be nice to just give her a key because then she can just come and walk inside when I have. Here you go, come on by whenever you want. Yeah. Uh, joke about old times. <laughs> Do you remember when when uh, my, my auntie had seven kids and then I was the one Child from, from Rai, uh, and then I became the most popular and favorite. <laughs> yeah, that was a good time. <laughs> oh my God, no way, that's so cool. <laughs> All right, I need to go, okay, I still haven't actually done it. Well, I, I think we did shower, but 
The quick and tepid shower is not that quick, or... I mean, it is quick, sorry. <laughs> but it doesn't do very well. Okay, Chris is leaving, that's all good. Yeah, it doesn't... We need to build up our water. We are getting water, we are getting power, but not a lot. All right, let me get some leftovers. Okay, the hygiene a lot better now. Flame is eating some prairie grass. Very nice. If we harvest some of these, we can probably get a bunch of free cool stuff too. All right, we're gonna go to bed real bad. I also gotta auto light everything. Uh, auto light, all candles. I th oh yeah, of course, I'm in the room. All righty. God, I'm so tired. All right, hopefully by, oh, look at all these sleeping. Chicken sleep. I don't know how that, that one chick has like four different sleeping spots. Oh, look, they're sleeping together. That's so cute. Okay, water surplus. So we're making water now. Have we have we built up power at least? Minus 13. Is that less or more? That's, uh, I don't know. We might need to invest in like solar panels as well, to be honest. Oh no, I'm stinking over there. Dirty, unhappy. All right, clean. Don't worry, mum is coming. I kind of want to, I, I think I might need to add a back door just so we don't have to walk all the way around the front. Even though it's like the world's smallest cabin. Aw, flame. Oh, I should fill that feeder. <laughs> I filled theirs, I forgot about flames. Uh, refill that with prayer grass. There you go, nice and clean. You're good too, how's my little chick? Chick is good. Oh, wait, do I have animal aging on? Cause we definitely need that on. Uh, animal aging is on. Which is unfortunate, cause it obviously means we're gonna have to lose the animals. But if we don't have that on, that's also a problem. So we, we do need that. All right, there you go. Is the chick gonna eat from this? Is that what's happening right now? Oh no, I think it's just chilling. All right, well, the good thing is now that we've got a pond here as well, we can also gather water from here. So I can just get extra water for myself. There we go, which is pretty sweet. Should probably uh, gather all this manure as well around the place. All right. Oh, actually that's the other thing. So the umbrella, I'm not saying if we get the, oh, 150. If we get the little umbrella stand, we can put the, um, oh gosh, put the umbrella in that. So then lady stops pulling it out all the time, which if, if true, that's big because it's super annoying. And she doesn't need it because we're waterproof. So I can go use the toilet and let's go to, oh, we can take a regular shower. All right, are we generating power yet? Let's have a look. Minus 12, we're getting there. It's slow, it's slow going, but we're definitely getting there. Oh, look at Flame hanging out with the animals. I mean, they're having negative interactions, so I don't know what's going on there, but whatevs. Wee! Yeah! Oh, that's so nice. You know, I, I like that Flame could go in here. Flame's like, I'm, yeah, you guys suck, I'm out of here, bye. <laughs> All right, so I'm a little hungry. Oh, wait, how do I receive phone calls if I can't make them? Also, oh my gosh! I found a ring in Ebony's bag. I think she's gonna propose to me. Should I say yes? Yes! Yeah, let's go. You're right, of course I should say yes. What was I thinking? Oh my God, I can't believe this is happening. It's happening. That's actually really cool. So Ebony, uh, I wonder if, is that like instant or does that take some time? Like, can I see it in that family tree now? No, I can't see it yet. So Ebony is one of Vlad's like 50 children. He had like 50 children in my save game. So <laughs> it's one of, one of Vlad's uh, clan, if you will. This vampire clan. Is it called a clan? A vampire? Was it just family? What do, you, what do you call it? Oh, a coven. Wait, isn't that witches though? A vampire coven? Huh. Yeah, they're, they're also called a coven. There you go. Yeah, part of <laughs> Vlad's coven. There you go. All right, well, I guess, okay. Hey, someone said if I just walk off the lot, then I can call, like I can use power. Is that true? Can I, can I call here? Oh my gosh. <laughs> <laughs> I just have to step off the boundary of my lot. I have like a void. I don't know, I've got some EMP shield around my lot that blocks all cell signal. But just out here I can I can call, so that's fine. Hire a service, good, because I just want to do it. Ranchan, for $100 plus 12 an hour. Ooh, I got $100 right now. Should we, I mean, we'll just do it, right? Let me, let me harvest, um, all the paragraphs, maybe we can find some stuff to sell. All righty. Thank you for contacting Buckaroo Brigade Ranch Services. We'll help, we help with ranches, with livestock care, general repairs, and gardening. Uh, you hired, uh, <laughs> you hired Ranch Hand. Wait, what? Let me, let me try again. Your hired Ranch Hand will work every day from 7 a.m. to 7 p.m. Wow, that's a, that's a long day. Wait, wait, $100 plus 12 an hour. So that's like, what, 250-ish, right? Something like that. Oh, here we go, Ranch Hand. Hey there, I'm your Ranch Hand. My name is Shafik. Nice to meet y'all. I'm good with animals, plants, and repairs. Let me know and I'll handle it. This ranch is gonna run like a well-oiled machine. Oh, and if you want me to harvest plants or pick up manure, just ask, otherwise I'll leave it to you. I wanna make sure that's what you'd want. You never know. All right, cool. So they're already off helping in there. And I found, oh, I found a tomato, really? That's what I found? Okay, hey Flame. Actually, you know what, Flame? Why don't we do a competition? Good old competition. <laughs> okay, so we've got gold. Which ones have we, we haven't done this one. Oh, you know what? Let's try get our jumping skill up first. Uh, that's not jumping. Hang on, hang on. Right, no more prairie grass. So my needs are pretty good. I do have a bunch of stuff in here. I could probably just sell stuff, but I'm trying not to do that, you know? 
Alrighty, let's jump on flame. Let's head over here and do some jumping. Uh, let's get, how are you going? How, how are the animals? You're running around. Okay, also good to see they can actually get in there because glad I locked that properly. Seems pretty good. So I guess she's taking care of them. She'll probably help with the horse bed. Means I can sort of focus on the competition stuff. We're not too far off the next jumping skill level. Very nice, good stuff. Let's go. How's our power generation going? I think it's slowly creeping up. We've got two water. Only minus 11 now, good. Whee! Oh look, she's making friends with them. That's good. That's actually really good. Well, yeah, uh, so apparently sometimes we have to rehire a ranch hand every day. Oh gosh, I think she, did she just get bit by the goat? Oh no, she, I think she got rammed. This goat does not like her. <laughs> Sorry about that. Yeah, you know, these things happen. All right, how's our, we're nearly next level jumping skill. I'm also nearly next level riding skill. Maybe one more jump. Yeah, is that it? No, no, not quite. One more jump. Yeah, that's it. Yeah, there you go. Okay, cool. All right, let's see if we can do a competition. The jumping, we both have enough skill. Cost me a hundred dollars to enter. So if we don't win this or win some money in this, I'm not gonna be able to pay our, uh, <laughs> our ranch. Hey, what are you doing in my house? Oh, you're like cleaning up. Oh, hey, Oak. Um, yeah, you're still banned. Send home. <laughs> you're still, you're still estranged because you try to burn down my last house. All right, so now where, but wait, where am I going? Lady's going inside the house for some reason. Oh, she just faded away there. Okay. All right, so we're doing the jumping competition. All the other animals seem like they're being taken care of, which I'm really proud of. Oh, don't worry about that. <laughs> uh, the bed is slightly dirty, but it looks like she's trying to clean it maybe. I think she actually picked up manure maybe. There's also a pile of trash there, what the heck? <laughs> hey, 300 bucks. Okay, so we won gold, let's go. Very nice. All righty, fantastic. Let's add that to our ranch sign. Uh, we got a bit of room up there, there we go. You know, we're getting pretty full. <laughs> so I faded back in over there, but Flame's over here. Okay, so wait, what is Flame worth now? That's the real question. 1650, that's pretty good cash money. Um, okie dokie, so, well, I gotta make nectar and stuff, hey. Should probably do that. Let me go clean this thing out. Ranch what can I do? Assign chores, ask to... So they water plants and they make repairs, but they don't collect manure. Oh, so collected manure will be in the household inventory, okay. Uh, and that will, oh. P plants in the household inventory is really annoying. Unless you can use, can you use plants from the household inventory for nectar making? If that's the case, then that's fine. Uh, but I'll just leave them. I, I don't think we need them to harvest for me. All right, let's go ahead and craft nectar. Um, so we are level four. I guess I should just do energy nectar. Let's do a few of those. Let's just do as many as we can because we're not gonna have a lemon tree for a while again. There it is. Uh, are you rummaging through my trash? What the heck? <laughs> Okay, going to my sink in my bathroom. You know, we do have other sinks on the property, like there and the one outside. Oh, and you're helping yourself to my fridge. Oh wait, no, you're cleaning up. Okay, okay, thank you. So I should probably go talk to you. <laughs> not actually get to know you maybe. All right, what do we got? Oh, we got football team sports day. <laughs> right, we got a uh, excellent quality nectar. All right, we'll put that in our excellent rack, which is in here. Oh, <laughs> a little excellent rack room. All right, where's Shafik? There you are. Oh wait. Your name is Huda. Wait, didn't you say your name was Shafik? My name is Shafik, but your name is Huda. All right, whatever. Um, compliment. Give, no, not pep talk. Uh, interests. Do you like horses? Can I talk about horses maybe? Nope, there's no There's no way I can talk about horses. Hobbies? Horse riding, there, there we go. Oh, oh yeah, I've got money now. Actually, I should probably keep this money because I think I need to pay you. <laughs> can I give you a tip? Uh, 100, oh, I can give you money. Here you go, I'll give you a hundred bucks. I know this is not actually paying them, it's just for funsies, but you know, oh, what? I asked if you like horse riding and you got a negative, I got a negative response for that. The heck? You're a ranch hand. I was like, hey, what do you what do you think about horse riding? Ugh, God, that's the worst. Well, you like the money, okay. Uh, can we can we hang out after work? I've got no friends. I'll be asked to cow, oh, cowpoke dance. I don't think we've done that yet. I haven't even seen it yet, except for the trailers. Hey, ha wait, how is she using her phone? We're off the greedy, we've got no power. We're gonna cowpoke dance together? Here we go, oh, keep an umbrella. I gotta get rid of that umbrella. Yeah! Well, you're dancing. Am I gonna dance or am I not? <laughs> yeah, look at that go. Whoa! And that's how we do the do si -do. That, I mean, that's not the do si -do, but yee-haw! Let's go, wee! <laughs> Sweet. <laughs> you know, we're just two ranchers just dancing away, uh, potentially in the mud because it is raining. Uh, you know, it's nice. It's different. It's all good. <laughs> yeah! All right, so that's good. So Flame is sleeping. Um. All right, I do need to make money though, don't I? So can I? Well, we're making money from nectar, really. Yes, I like dancing, sure. It's good, okay, it's a, <laughs> the ranch hand's like, okay, bye. Okay, I'm, they're nearly done for the day at 7 p.m. So hopefully I have enough, ooh, actually I might not have enough money now because I just gave them a hundred bucks. Uh, I'm, normally I don't do this, 
but I'm gonna sell these robotic upgrade parts. That was only $35? Okay, that did not give me as much as I thought it would. I'm gonna sell, uh, uh, maybe the nectar bottle. Oh, but no, but that was excellent quality. Oh, but I need to, I need the money. All right, I'm gonna sell up. Okay, I think we have enough money now to pay them. So that's good. All right, let me, let's make some more nectar. We, we, we do have to build up an inventory of nectar. So let's get on that. So I, I'm curious though, to see how much we pay at 7 p.m. Cause I don't, I, we need to start from right in the morning. Yeah, look at it go. All right, so 7 p.m., here we go. Is the ranch hand leaving? When do I pay them? Oh, my horse is getting temperament skill. What? <laughs> they had a negative interaction. Uh, oh, okay, I got an extra bottle of nectar. Fantastic and excellent quality. Let's go. All right, so let's chuck these down in the cellar. Are these both excellent? Yes, they are. Beautiful. There you go, we didn't lose any. Got an extra one. Let's go back to grape. Good old fashioned grape. So is this ranch hanging to leave or they're just hanging out now? Also, I'm getting old, by the way. I need that vitality nectar to stay young at all. Otherwise we're gonna die. <laughs> Before this let's play's over. Oh, she's hanging out with the little chick. Oh, look at that. Whoa! Whoa! Oh my god, you're gonna kill Batu. Careful. Holy moly, that was close. Batu, watch out! No! Uh, okay, we're good. Whew. How's everyone's actual need? You're good, excellent. Yeah, I mean, I feel like the ranch hand. I don't know if they're doing their job, but it's definitely working. So. You can't go. Oh, wait, is Krista here? Apparently, I'm talking to her. Hi, it's me, Krista. I thought I'd just come by now that we've got a key, you know. Just hang out. Yeah, 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 I'm just trying to make nectar right now, Krista. Not right now. You know, this is this is a lot of work. It's kind of tough. You can just come back in a few minutes. Yeah, no, I don't mind. I'll just stand here and watch like really closely if that's cool. Yeah, it's just, um, you know, I got a bunch of kids back home. I don't really want to take care of them. Yeah, that's great. But I, this is this is a lot of work right now. Okay, just. <laughs> oh God, yeah. She's like, Krista, can you, can you not? Can you not right now? So, okay, is this branch gonna go home? Or are they, what, what's happening? Do they just live here now? I guess so. All right, well, I'm gonna try and make like as much nectar as we can uh, so that we can just sort of store it up. So I've got another, what was this one? Oh, yeah, see, okay. Excellent quality grape nectar. At least this one seems to be more, more valuable than the excellent quality uh, energy nectar. So that's 170, this is 197. So that's pretty good. Are you gonna go home? <laughs> I mean, they just, it's 9 p.m. So I don't know. Oh my God, Krista, <laughs> good, good luck. Yeah, it's me, you know, I like it when it rains. It feels really good on the skin. Also, why is she not moving? I'm kind of scared. Like she's literally glued. <laughs> ah, what? Are you gonna move? Are you okay? Like the game isn't paused right now. And she's literally not breathing. Krista, Krista, wake up, <laughs> please talk to me. <laughs> Oh gosh, she's back. Okay, good. <laughs> she's alive. That was a close one. All right, I need to make some more nectar. Oh, look what hugging you're making up. Isn't that nice? All right, you can go home now, by the way, if you want. That's cool. Oh, you just run in circles. Okay, or you can run through my trash or... Wait, where do they go? Do they go home now? Oh no, they're over here. Oh, they're recycling. Okay. Wait, do I get that? Hey, you just took my trash and took the recycling from me. Oh my God, what is this? Festering bitterness? Wait, what? From someone nearby? What? Wait, what happened between you two? I look away for like a second. Festering grudge? What? Lady has a deep seated grudge against Krista. When did that happen? <laughs> what? what? What the heck happened? Ooh, two excellent bottles of grape nectar. Let's go. All right, well, we're very quickly stocking up on excellent bottles. I kind of want bad bottles too. Like, like I want bottles that aren't always excellent. You know what I mean? I guess maybe if I don't clean it, cause I did just clean it again. All right, you know what, Krista? Uh, you can go home if you want. Okay, I think the ranch hand is actually leaving now. So the ranch hand left. Do I, did I spend money? I assume so, cause I had, wait, I had more money than that, right? I don't know. All right, make more nectar. Stomp on them grapes, let's go. That's excellent quality as well. That must be excellent too, cause it's in the same stack. Fuse all those grapes up. Yes, good, fall in it whilst you're stinking too. <laughs> Give it the nasty flavor. Like surely, how could this possibly be excellent? I'm stinking and literally falling in it covered in mud. Okay, this has gotta be nasty. Nope, it's excellent, okay. <laughs> One death flower for the, we need to actually, we need to get death flower, which I guess we could either try and make it or we could try and buy it. So we got a few options there. All right, let's do one more grape nectar, cause why not? Oh, did I give up? I gave up cause I, I, my mood is too bad. Okay, just, can we just finish this and then we go to the other stuff? She is so stinky. No, no, I don't care if you're stinky, go finish the nectar. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, fall in it. Yeah, look at flame go, let's go. All right, yeah, just fall in it a few times while you're extra stinky to give it extra flavor. Okay, this is excellent. Okay, how is that excellent? 
<laughs> it's the exact same price. Has someone made a mod yet for Nectar to like make it more, I mean, it's good that we're making a lot of money, but I wouldn't mind more challenging uh, options too. Cause that's gonna be worth so much money if we let it be completely finely aged. Anyway, let's go take care of our needs. That was flame. Uh, butler was adopted. Okay, good, good for you. Oh wait, no, butter, not butler. Yeah, flame is in a great mood, which is fantastic. How much power do we have these days? Have we have we built up power yet? Only minus nine. Okay. Rate of change. How did we use minus seventy five water? Holy moly! What did we use that on? How's our? Oh wait, why is there no ice in my fridge? They're already run out. I thought it took like forever last time. Okay, is there ice in there now? There is. Okay. Clean out spoiled food first of all. All right, what can I actually make? Because I do have some stuff on me. Uh, Cause we've got simple living. So obviously there's not much, oh my gosh. Can it just show me the ones I can actually make? Like, that'd be good. Is there, can I make anything else? <laughs> uh, no. So flour and sugar, oh, cricket flour. That's right. Onion and meat. Oh. So I can make fruit salad. Let's make a party size of fruit salad. There you go. Wait, is that thing where we can stop it using electricity? Is that an upgrade that we have to do? Is it a fuel cell? No, that's just when we put in stuff. Energy? I don't know. I don't know, but there doesn't seem to be an option to stop this using power like people mentioned. At least not that I can see, but I'm sure you'll tell me if I'm wrong. So please let me know. Oh, actually, what about canning? Is there anything I can can? No, <laughs> I don't have enough of anything. Any mushroom, aubergine, soybean, or faux meat cube. That would probably be good. The meat, the meat substitute, actually, any mushroom, because then I think we can use that in some recipes as well. Because some of them say meat substitute, for example, faux meat casserole. So we could probably make that if we grow some mushrooms. Then maybe that's an idea. But that's going to have to be an idea for the next episode because I spent so much time building and preparing stuff. Uh, <laughs> Flame is having a great time down there. Just like my top level members, thank you so much for supporting the channel. I really appreciate it. I'm really excited that we've got this. Whoa, okay, the game's going too fast, slow down. I'm really excited that we've got this whole new ranch area. Um, we've got a little chick going. I guess we should look into a second horse. I think I want to get a second horse before we get a cow or a llama. Um, so we'll see how that goes. But until then, thank you so much for watching. I'll see you next time. And don't be a stranger now, you hear? <laughs> and have an awesome day.